Hi everybody, welcome to the channel. I'm Ola and this is part two of Red Dead Redemption 2. In the last episode, we've just been kind of learning the ropes, seeing who everybody is, and quite literally, actually, because at the end of last episode, I do recall hog tying someone, so that's that was fun. Um, we do have a quest we need to do over here in this building, it looks like, but I kind of wanted to see if anyone has anything new to say and see if anyone's moved around or what have you. So let's just do that. Um. <coughs> oh, this is the quest guy. Death up here, Mr. Morgan. Why? Why would you say something like that? Um, okay, so we have- we're definitely going through some growing pains with the buttons, but that's alright. We'll get there. Hold on. Okay, where was everybody? Everyone was in one of these buildings, right? <gasps> Gorgeous! This was my room, right? Oh! Oh! What's going on there? Send someone down the track back to that farmhouse. Okay. <gasps> Why? That poor woman's husband needs burying. Oh, interesting. Of course, uh, is it safe down there? Oh, just send someone sensible. Understood. Hosea right. seems really reliable. Whoa, we came back in here and everything's new. They're saying new stuff. And that was really respectful of Dutch. Do you say something new when I talk the to you? Body's in a wagon out front of the house. I'll send someone. Thanks, Jose. The details. Anyway, try not to worry. Stay warm. Okay, Arthur. <laughs> okay, Molly's over How here you now. Doing, Molly? So now you're robbing a train. Um. How is that going to help us? I'd speak to Dutch about that. Not sure. Is there anything new in our journal, perhaps? How do we get to the journal? I think it was this button. Yes. Since we're by the fire. Um, R1 for page. I don't want to muck that up. Okay, so train. Ooh, this is new. I love the simplicity of, of the pencil work. Like, how just a few lines could look like horses and people on them. That's cool. Riding out. Let's read this. Ridge. Leviticus Cornwall? Question mark? Seems Colm O'Driscoll had the same ideas as us. He's been hiding up here, scouting out a train he wanted to rob. We bumped into some of his boys at some farmstead they was robbing. Found that poor woman whose husband they had murdered, and she's now riding with us as she ain't got no place better to be. Then Dutch being Dutch and his hatred for Colm being just as powerful as it ever was, a whole bunch of us went to pay him a visit in his camp, but he escaped. Okay, so he must have just escaped during the hubbub. But, interesting. Oh, yeah, we did the chapter thing. Ooh, wow, look at that upgraded train. Oh, okay, sweet, I see. That's the next place, next page anyways. We grabbed at one of his boys, poor bastard, ain't spoken yet, but he will, what was his name, Kieran? Um, but he will once... But he will, once we freeze him a little, that set Bill on him. Been a bad few weeks, but we're mostly still alive. Dutch being Dutch is busy making plans and figuring out just how we're going to survive. And Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Dutch has big dreams. Big dreams, guy. But look at this. Look at this train evolution from this. I just think it's great. Okay, that looks like that was it in there. Wonderful. Does Dutch have anything new to say? You went back here, I think? Yes. Good call, Dutch. It's the least we can do for the poor woman. That's really nice. I'd say Micah should do it, but that ain't a good idea. I don't think Micah should be trusted to do anything important. He seems like a loose cannon. But Dutch seems to like him, so... Whatever. Oh. Oh. Who's that? Is Hosea going to go do the thing? Is that Hosea? No, right? No. We just walked by him. 
Oh, someone's on guard. Can we talk to them? Lenny. Hey. It's a great name. What's up, Lenny? How are you holding up? Okay, I guess. Okay. That's great. I love just like talking to everybody and getting to know what's what's on everyone's mind. It's just so fun. Like if there's new dialogue in here after all the dialogue we just had, then I'm going to be shocked. Eaten by wolves. Never heard such a ridiculous <gasps> idea. Who gets themselves eaten by wolves? I mean, really who? Oh, is that mean to Abigail? You never mean to. You always do. Always trouble. Is that wolf confirmation? Well, I've certainly made my mistakes. What's that supposed to mean? Cool. Whatever you want it to. You are an annoying man, John Marston. I mean, you just shut up and get some rest. You tell him. What? That's wild. So, wolves. It was the wolves. You okay, Abigail? Yeah. Oh, sorry. How'd you boys get on with the old Driscoll's? Sorry. It's dealt with. For now, anyway. You feeling any better? Uh, not a whole lot. Oh. Can't seem to get warm. Well, I'm hoping we can get out of here soon. Does everyone say new stuff? All here while we were gone? I think so. I slept for most of it. T typical. All right, Mr. Strauss? Yes, Hello. happy you boys all made it back in one piece. You okay? Just about. Just about. You've done the best you can with this place, Miss Grimshaw. Smoking. It could be worse, given the circumstances. No doubt. I got a bunch of ciggies, too. Hey, Cat. I'm glad you boys made it back all right. We was worried. Yeah, hopefully we could get out of this hellhole soon. I don't think we could have talked to him before, right? Reverend? I wish I did. Mm. Yep. We need something. Sadie. Mrs. Adler, once we get off here, is there somewhere we can take you? Uh, no. I, I don't know. I don't really have anyone. Okay. Well, you can stay with us as long as you want. Her husband. That's so sad. Well, at least he'll get buried. Properly. All right. Okay. I think I'm ready for this quest. I've like, I've warmed up my fingies. We'll see what this is. Okay. Who are you? P. Uh, great. We're okay. We have aftermath a few cans of Genesis of and a rabbit for what? 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy, I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pierce. We were stranded at sea for 50 days, and you unfortunately survived. <gasps> when we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Oh. Government agents are hunting you down. Sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Oh, crap. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found nothing. Enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Okay. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted offal. Starving will be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. Yeah. Hard to rest on an empty stomach. <coughs> cool.
cool. Here, you take this. <gasps> I can't use it. You'll have to. Cool. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. That's that's true. Never too old to learn. I imagine. Oh no, I'm gonna have to use a bow. All right, let's head out. Twenty-two arrows and assorted salt, salted offal. Okay, how do we do this again? X. Okay, we're off to the races. Go, how Charles. Up, I'm sorry. I'm learning again. Uh, careful. I'm okay. Apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. What'd you do? It'll bad. It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. Uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. Wow. So, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill that ain't an old Driscoll? Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way. Find some higher ground. <sighs> Doesn't know what he's talking Been about. A wild few days, all right. That right north from Blackwater. Getting stuck in the storm. Going out for John. That thing with the old Driscolls. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that. Just Aww. a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. Well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. Oh, cutscene? It's so beautiful. Okay, let's go. Let's go find some game. Wonder what we'll find. Wonder how difficult this is going to be. Gorgeous around every corner. How do you be nice to your horse again? Um, There's some patches of grass. I don't remember. Here. This is good. Yeah. Let's look down this way. Hmm. The winds died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. Mm. Now, shh. Stay quiet. I'm trying. As quiet as I could be on a horse. Can't talk to Charles. Hey, Which is oh stop here a second. Okay. I see something. Where? Easy. What do you see? Oh, coming. Are we getting off? Oh, it just got off for me. Has deer been here? Oh, deer. Recently. Oh, deer. How can you tell? How can you not? Let's walk it. Don't patronize here. me, Charles. You're gonna need the bow. Don't oh. leave it on your horse. A gun will scare right. everything around. Approach your horse. How do we do this? L1, okay. And then this one's flashing, and then we R2? No. Hunt for deer. Stay low. L3. You got it, boss. Is this slow enough? There's no, like, noise meter or anything? I think so. Yeah, Maybe I see not. them. Focus. I don't see them. Eagle eye? What's that? You can use eagle eye to highlight animal tracks and other clues. <gasps> Press L3 and R3. Oh my goodness, I got witcher shit. Focus on track. R1. They remain okay. highlighted? Okay. I don't see I don't see them very well. But once you get your eye in... You'll be able to track nearly as well in grass and woods. Can't see shit in the snow. There's like a timer on it. That's stressful. Can I can I get it back? Is it use dead eye juice? Stop tracking. 
Huh. This is so interesting. Okay, it's almost done, I think. And then what? Can we just use it again right away? How do we enable- okay, like this, I think? Your scent is also shown in eagle eye blowing in the direction of the wind. Animals will flee if they smell your scent, so remain downwind or far away. <gasps> Fascinating. It says unknown animal. What if it's not deer and something crazy? Is Charles here? Okay, Charles is still here. Charles. You seen anything else, buddy? Oh! Oh, I see it. I see a deer. Oh my god, okay, what well, now what? Now what? Now what? Okay, we have to be quiet. Down there. Ready you the arrow. Him? L2. Quick. Get that bow out, Arthur. Okay, okay, okay. Aim for their head or neck. We want a good Ah. The further you draw you the strike pad hard. You'll feel when it's too much. We'll reset your aim. Take the shot. Ah, I'm nervous. Okay, where is it? So if we call... Ooh, but this is a good shot. Oh, we got like a sway situation. Oh my goodness. Oh, nice! Another one? We're just gonna leave that one there? Okay. Hunt another deer. Do you have mates? Selecting call while aiming at it. This will give you a chance of a clean kill before they raise their as they raise their head before fleeing. That's actually kind of cool. Um, or one. So is this just the dead one? But I, I'm sure you two travel together, right? So we can't do anything with this one right now. Oh. Oh. Okay, never mind. We got our bow back, which is really interesting. Or sorry, our arrow, which is cool. Okay, wait, let me get out of the water. Okay, where's... Oh, this one. It must be this one, because I don't think this one made it across. Okay, cool. Oh, and it shows our carcass, like an animal carcass, as a just like a paw print. Okay. I should probably get down. Oh, it's right there. Oh my god. It's right there. What a dingus. Ready? I'm not- I'm not ready. Oh, oh my god. Well Study an animal. Ah, oh, what? Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the other. You sure your hands are okay? Uh, it'll oh. be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Okay. Okay. I'll go grab the other one. So we can't study it dead, obviously, right? Well, I would like to study it. It says something about R1. Hold. Get our arrows back. That's so interesting, but like makes sense. I'm so sorry, dear. Oh dear. To pick it up? Okay, let's pick it up. Companion tracks what you have discovered. Oh, it just did it for me. What? Oh. What? White tailed deer tracked to, killed to, are found in a variety of habitats across the states, but are common in the forests of New Hanover, Lemoyne, and West Elizabeth. Their herbivorous diet includes grasses, nuts, fungi, twigs, and fruit. Keeping your distance when hunting deer can increase your chances of a kill as they are easily startled. Whoa, it like tells you how to deal with them. Long range weapons such as a rifle or a bow with poison arrows, we get poison arrows, are considered to be the best when hunting. Deer hide can be used for crafting and their venison meat can be used for cooking. Crafting? This is so in depth. That's cool that like everything is kept track of and I could just like if I'm hunting something I guess I could be like yo what do I do with this again and then just look it up in the compendium that's cool whistle for your horse as long as it's in range continue to bond with your horse ooh I forget how to bond with my horse there was like a a nice button or something 
uh, a, a good boy button. Approach the back. Okay, so... Cool, cool, cool. I think that was alright. We're just gonna huck this on the back? Oh my goodness. Stow. Like this. Not bad, boy. No game. Whatever. There was no food. Whatever. Mount your horse. Meet up with Charles. Where's Charles at? I'm all turned around this way. Okay, yellow. I see. Yep. <gasps> okay, that could be fun. Ready to head back when you are. Let's go, Charles, well, buddy. Let's head back. Fun. Let's. We got so much food oh. now. We got venison, and we can ah. craft with the hide. Carcasses at nice the butcher work, thingy Arthur. to contribute to gang to supplies. Cool. Fed for a few days. You found him. Gang supplies. I knew you'd be okay with that bow. Yeah, it's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Yeah, mm, that's true. You're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, <laughs> and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. That's so that funny. We more than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. <laughs> one more. We ain't feeding the old Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful Pearson was kind enough to give us. Mm. The girl. She has a wild look in her eye. I thought so too. Uh, of course. Sadie, I'm assuming, Lost right? Her husband, yeah. Her home, everything she had. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll for us. <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that fight. He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with the O'Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Yeah, we ain't run into them much the last six months. The ice looks so good. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah. I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big gang. Nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Combe, and Dutch go way back, and not in a good way. A proper blood feud. So I heard. Damn. I think Dutch said he killed his brother or something. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Where? Let's see if we can find another way around. Oh shit. Um, that's pretty wild. Can we? He's got a lot of meat can on I study him? it? We've got enough here. No <gasps> can we go for the bear? Up. What if we go Must for the bear? Real hungry. Stay well back. I'm not going Spend near that thing. Like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. Okay, the bear's crossed. I didn't get a chance to study it though. Fascinating. Am I about to get jumped by a fucking bear? Cut up here, off the trail. Where is it? I lost track. Oh, there it is. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. L3. Easy, boy. Hold L3. Oh, interesting. I think that was the nice button. <gasps> Horse plus. Yep, that's the one. But I wanna... I really wanted to study it. Okay, that's okay. We ain't ever talked that much, you and me. There must be other bears. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that. I'm gonna get myself hey, killed. didn't expect this. What? Any of this. It's kind of new. Blackwater mess. Being up here. Ah, 
Sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just... I know you can run it alone, no problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch... You know... Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly different. He treats huh. me fair. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Hmm. Well, we need you now. More than ever. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh. 20 years, something like that. 20 years? Since I was a boy. Oh, I didn't think it was... 20 years? Yeah. <laughs> taught me to read. Wow. John, too. Huh. Taught me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. They're like family. That saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. Okay. Dutch he lore. He sees us right. I'm seeing where the respect for Dutch is coming from. How's that new horse? He's all right. He'll do for now. I don't know if we can name it. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with the Bill Count. And Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but oh. he loves that horse. <laughs> I hope they all make it. So the count is Dutch's horse. The count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. That's a crazy looking horse. I can't help but getting caught up in looking around. I'm just getting lost in the Gorgeous background, like what? This is wild. Okay, let's drop off this. Look, the snow has gathered on my freaking deer carcass. I'm gonna hitch time over here. The details. I am gushing Lots over this game. Food back, boys. <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. Remove white tail Come deer. On, get these over to Pearson. Uh, thank you for showing me how to use the bow properly. I only showed you a little. It takes a lifetime um, of practice to master. My horse just pooped. Your horse can poop? <laughs> Speaking of the details of that game, no freaking away. Okay. Good work, Bart. All right. <laughs> What a mess. Okay, anyways. <laughs> well, well, well. <clears throat> drop. Here you go, buddy. Just drop it. What a surprise. I find a camp rat loitering <laughs> around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid you. Why, he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. <laughs> now shoot, get lost. <laughs> well... See you gents later. See, you Bye. got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yes. Oh. Seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. I'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's the, easier if we do the it white now? We'll get to skin you. <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. What'd you do to your hand? How'd you, you burn it? That one you, you dumped on the floor there. Are you serious? I thought I was done. I just did all the other work. Hold. We're skinning this? <laughs> oh, it can't be that bad, right? Is it just gonna, like, skip over the yuck? It does not skip over anything! 
<laughs> okay. Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. Okay. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Wow. <laughs> well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. That is something. <coughs> that is definitely something. A few days later, and we unlocked something. Master Hunter? Cool. Ah, oh, gorge. Gorgeous. It's been a bad few weeks. But Dutch, being the Dutch, he is busy making plans, and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. It was in our journal. Who the hell is Levit Leviticus Cornwall? Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him <laughs> to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respects, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. Arthur's Still funny. Here, then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. Oh. Want me to come? Of course I right do. Right now? Look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. That's what I oh, said. Oh, Abigail. What? Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He's seen me now. Or what's left of me. What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. <laughs> You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway man. Bill! Now, you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah. That's true. Come on. What do you want from me, Hosea? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. We can't. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? We could not. Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? You know, he's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil, oil man. man. Well, uh, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob! The Count. All right! We're moving out! Follow me! I can't believe we're doing this. Are we doing this right now? One of three deer skinned? Yeah. Do we get rewards? <gasps> what time okay, is it? Gentlemen, oh. Listen up, all of you. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the O'Driscolls, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're gonna pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep a lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars, deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. The back. Got you it. You and me, Morgan. Great. Great. Have you got a problem with that? Not if you keep your head for once. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough! <laughs> after Bill blows the tracks, we're gonna need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep. Crystal. Back. Yes, boss. Back, Good. Yep. Now, come on! <laughs> I have this like weird like Hosea's either being too cautious but maybe not I think Jose is being quite reasonable and being like yo we're supposed to be laying low right now and Dutch is just kind of like balls to the wall 
He's got, he's a man with a plan. And he's got big dreams that he wants to come to fruition, so nothing's gonna stop Dutch, despite, in this case, Jose is moaning, I guess, but I don't know. I'm just gonna rob a train, just like that. I'm a little nervous about- <gasps> Out of the snow. Wow. Feels good, doesn't it? Sorry. But we need to get this done fast. Now it's thawing before anyone gets up here after us. Gorgeous. Oh, look at you boys. See? This is what I call a crew. Micah Bell. Green. Charles Smith. Arthur Morgan. Javier Escuela. And what about young Lenny here? Always the first man on his horse. Good old Lenny. Just happy we're back at him, Dutch. You sure you're ready for this, kid? Of course I'm ready. Just stay calm. Keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. No mistakes. It is Not nice again. being out of the snow. So we do this, then we go back to Blackwater to collect. How many times you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place oh, will sorry. be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I sorry. say we go back, and that's the end of it. The money's safe. You'll just have to trust me. And if the O'Driscolls are right, there'll be a stack of railroad bonds on this train. That'd be cool. Good money once we work out how to cash them. Now everyone, shut up and get your mind on the job at hand. Come on. There's a water tower. Hold this game looks real. Bridge. Okay, ridge, water tower. Oh, I see tracks. Is this the place? I can't, I am just gushing over how this game looks. Look at that. Okay, I'm done. Done gushing. All the horses are pooping. <laughs> Is Bill there? Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. Um, I'm assuming not with my horse. Oh my, what happened? Dutch with the binoculars? What a crew. What a what a great group. Okay. Ah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna take my time, Dutch. Okay. I'm just gonna walk because I'm enjoying the view. Um Yep. I'm enjoying this nice little creek here. Oh my god. I just want to explore everything. Hey, where's Bill? Check on Bill, okay. Oh, he's, I see yellow, a yellow thing. Okay, cool. We're so broke, although I don't know the equivalent of six dollars. Or like how much things are gonna cost. So... I feel pretty broke though. I see a horse over there, and Bill's over here somewhere? Where? Gorgeous day. Gorgeous day for a train robbing. Oh, I think I see him now. I'm kind of blending in with everything. How you getting on? Yeah. I'm okay. What do you need? You sure? Of course. Can I help a little? All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, huh? sure. Now just unspool the wire and yeah. then attach it to said detonator. Right. Pick up the spool. This one? It's the only one. It's the only spool around. Is that a lot of dynamite? I don't even know. Connect the wire to the detonator. Where's... Okay, I, I'm seeing. I wonder how long this game took to make. Anyways. Back to immersing myself. Spool detonator. Can you please not? Oh, it's just doing it for us? Okay. Kinda. Okay. Okay, we're ready. Alright. That should do it. 
You head back up to the others. I got it from here. This is making me nervous. <laughs> this feels like a bad idea. Ah, uh, anyways. That's a nice horse you got there. Oh, I can hear them talking from here. That's kind of cool, because you... I don't know if you would in real life, but... It is so nice to be out of the snow, I will say. It is- the thaw has, has arrived, so maybe we'll get to move- we'll, we get to follow the nice on? weather. Says all fine. We're good. We'll soon find out. Um... Okay, we're good. Everything okay? Yep. I think so. I think so too. Okay, cover your faces. Train should be huh? here any minute now. Cover my face with L1. Oh, <laughs> it's time! It's time! Let's do it. Wait, I did it wrong. How do you do it? Like this, and then you let go this way. Okay, figured it out. Oh, gotta conceal our faces. Oh, I can't believe we're doing this. <laughs> I hope it's just like easy Gentlemen, without a hitch. It's time. Okay, we gotta go to the back though. Me and Micah to the back. Good luck, all of you. Yeah. You all know what to do. Ah, <sighs> not right. Yeah. Here we go. Yep. Southern and Eastern Railway. Uh, shit, no, oh, why? Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Oh, Where did fuck. You um, it was fine. So my come fault. on. What do you mean, You're come thick. on? We're not you just going to pack it up now. and go home? Why are we running? Jump on the train? We could have just left. We didn't have to go through with this completely. I thought we were just going to be like, oh, well, and that's too bad. Here we go. Oh my god! <gasps> Is that Javier? Lenny! Oh, Grab I'm Lenny! I got, got you, buddy! You. Now stop yelling. Stop. Pull! Shit. Oh my god! Ah! Uh. You're okay! Now, let's go slow this thing down! <laughs> Where's Javier? I don't know, he fell off or something. He fell! The others will get him. You and me, big man. I thought we were gonna jump to the top. Should I get my gun out, maybe? Come on, we oh. need to stop this train. Can we loot shit? Okay, how do we cover? How do we cover? Wow, this place is so pick up. No. Yeah, you got him. You you get him, Lenny. L2. Send Lenny. Yes, you go. Okay. Hey. Take, take what? Ah, search drawer. We gotta go though. I don't have time to loot really. Even though I really want to. Cover transition. What does that mean? Dead eye stuff. Where's my gun? Cover, cover, cover! Is there another one? Yep, there sure is. Come out. Let's keep moving. Oh, right. That's that's on you there, bud. Yeah, I'm good. Okay, Lenny. Shouldn't we push up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. I don't know. Well, I hooked up the wire, but we won't mention that. Cover transition is can I don't get it. We gotta hurry. We have to stop this train. Pick up? I, what doing, I didn't kid. I didn't mean to pick up. I meant to loot. We have to stop this train. <laughs> In a minute. <laughs> I'm trying to loot and now we move up? Yeah, yeah, let's go. Oh, <gasps> there's shoes. Oh, <gasps> what happened? What? 
Ah, oh, shit. Lenny died? Oh my god, you <laughs> they can die? I'm like down here looting everything. Okay, so which one do we do? Checkpoint or mission? I'm going to assume it's checkpoint. <laughs> Lenny can fucking die. Oh my goodness. Okay, we can't loot. As much as I want to be a loot goblin, I just can't. We can't. Okay. Now we have knowledge. <laughs> Now we know <laughs> Lenny we can die. This train. There's another guard up ahead. You want me to take him? Um. You can yes. go. You go. Yellow tonics. Bitters. Nice. Okay, I'm just gonna go. I'm just going to go. It's fine. As tempting as it is, Lenny's more important. Okay, go. Oh, mm-hmm. I see you there. Oh. Ah! Let's keep moving. I'm trying. We gotta get this guy, Lenny. I can't- we can't loot anybody. Doing, Where do we go up? Okay, that one. <gasps> you killed Lenny. Therefore... Should we move up? Yeah. How are you doing there? I'm okay. If we don't stop this train soon, the other boys will never catch us. I know, just stay calm. Chewing on, to let's get to the front. Okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go. <gasps> ah, how do we fight back? Reverse the grapple, break free. En Engineers got moves, yo. I'm sorry, you, you did this to yourself. You should have just head in. You should have stayed hidden. Okay, we gotta go. Stop the train, just like that. When he can die. Oh, okay, so that. Oh my god, what? Oh, where's my hat? Where's my hat? Who took my fucking hat? Was it you? Lenny, I'm scared. We need the car at the back, right? Yep, keep pushing on. Here we go. Okay, I don't know. I don't know where. Ah, Who took my hat? Oh, oh there's, okay. there's heaps over you. here. Good. Oops. Damn, Oops. Oh. I'm doing the wrong button. I want to cover, but I'm not. <gasps> what happened now? Was it Lenny? Did Lenny fucking die again? Lenny. Lenny! Where's my hat, though? You're, you can just lose it? That's concerning. Look oh well. Got more coming off the train. Okay, so we know there was one up here. And we know there was one here. There better be some money up ah, ah. Right? Did we get him? We didn't. All these bastards must be guarding something. Shoot him! We need the car at the back, right? Oh, yeah. shit. Keep pushing on Watch out! Not for long. Got you in the leg. Nice, Lenny. Still okay? Lenny, that was awesome. I think so. Good. Where's there more? You? Who is this guy? Doing good, kid. Okay, we're doing better. <laughs> Where the hell are the others? I don't know. God damn it. We'll loot. I'm going to hope that we can loot after. Oh, there's a lot of. I swear. Could use a hand. Um. Sure. 
Good shooting, kid. Are we done? I can see now why the old Driscoll <gasps> brought so many boys up here for this. Yeah, there was a lot of men on that train. What? What? What's on the? What's on the back there? Where's? Where's my fucking hat? <gasps> Oops. Arthur, I'm sorry. I didn't, I didn't know you could just fall like that. I'm so sorry. Did we get hurt? I feel like I wasted my tonic. I thought there was going to be more, but that's okay. You two Is the fortification right? yes. temporary? Let's get the money and go. We got some fellers holed up in this last car. Okay. Oh, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Over here? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I was going to say. I my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. Oil we man. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Seems our friends have gone deaf. What are we going to do? Up a little. How? Ooh. Oh, that's fine. That's enough. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. Oh. You two boys, go blow that door open. Are you serious? You're dead serious. Okay. Now, don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Place dynamite. Okay. Seems good enough. Light the fuse. Do they know? Should we warn them? Step back. <laughs> They're not even gonna warn them. I'm wish. stepping back. I'd step back, fellas. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like we're all still too close somehow. Goodbye. Oh, <gasps> did it. Cowabunga, dudes. All right, come on. Just walk on out here. <laughs> We don't want to kill you. No funny business. We just want to rob your boss. Interesting. No red when we uh get on up there. Search that train. Oh my god, okay, so we can actually loot the train right now? Everything I've missed? Got Lenny killed for once or twice. Okay. Private car miracle tonic. Okay, let's go check out the train stuff. Look at this place. Wow. It's like a palace. Well, now Bougie. I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. I did find some fine brandy Arthur just now. Yeah, kid did good. Inspect. see you rushing to jump on that train. He's keen. I'll give you that. Rita. Okay. Let's see if we can get this open. Dear Mr. Cornwall, we are yet to receive a payment of two grand for the initial phase of exploration of the Waipiti Indian Re Reservation. Amberino, as agreed in the contract between Cornwall Kerosene and Tar and the Le Leyland Oil Development Company dated November 9th, 1898. On receipt of the funds, we will proceed with phases two and three of the project and present you with a... Bonds? I don't think so. James Critchley, yeah. head of accounts. Make yourself useful. At least we all know you can read. <laughs> Give me those. Missed payment. Did that go in our inventory? It's not on the table. Railroad contracts. Like, look at the Invoices, lighting bouncing off the blah, this blah, gross blah. table. You it's so anything? good. Not really. Sugar imports from the Spanish West Indies. A lot Cigar, of okay. Some fancy new boat he's ordered from Europe. I am not robbing another boat as long as I live. Valid. Have you checked all the drawers and cabinets? Working on it. I'm working on it. Yeah. We got bills. Oh, how much? Prominent Americans card? Huh? 25 bucks? Any luck, Arthur? Nothing I'm... much, yeah. Not yet, not yet. Another letter. Well, let's keep looking. Jameson? God damn O'Driscoll. Thank you for the telegram and your continued interest in the Jameson Mining Company. However, any news you have received of mismanagement... These just seem to be contracts. Arthur, have you looked down the end there? In Ansberg are simply fake, and I would urge you to question your sources. The coal industry is there quite different from the oil industry in a number of ways, so I certainly remain open to a business meeting at your convenience to exchange ideas and educate each other on our respective areas of corporate expertise. I would also be delighted to host you in Ann's 
Iceberg and give you a personal tour of the mine. Okay. Okay, okay. It's interesting that we get to keep that. That's nice because I feel like I didn't retain much information because they were talking over me. There's cabinet. Um, so no one's found anything? Just cigars and stuff? I hear a very expensive clock. Whoa. Can we take the fox? Hmm. Probably not. Ooh. Yeah, this looks like some. Lockbox, boys. I think we found something. Got him. There's nice. the bonds. Thank God. Come on. <clears throat> okay, we have a lot of looting to do. This place is so freaking bougie. Holy bananas. Oh, okay. What did you find? Maybe we don't get to loot. Bonds. That's okay. Is it worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of well, here. Well, about them. What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the to train. To me? Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. How do we make sure? When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. <gasps> Maybe we do get to loot. Okay, you boys. Okay, get on the train, quick. Oh, on I thought we were gonna have any bright ideas. I kill all three. Okay, you're getting away. Just behave. Don't be little shits. Come on, move. We won't tell a soul. I swear. Why are they going back in there? Go on. Okay, so can we like loot a bit? Go to the engine car to start the train. I guess that's why you're going back in there. Okay. So we're going to be here a while. That was fun. A whole train rob. I wonder if we can do that like out in the out in the world later on, because I still feel like I'm a, a little bit of tutorial land story building, you know, all that stuff. And I'm loving it, but I'm curious. I'm very interested in to see what we can do outside of a quest. Getting ahead of myself, though. But cool to know that you could just rob trains, I guess? I honestly thought when when Bill pulled the trigger and it didn't work, I thought we were just going to turn around and go home, but obviously not. <laughs> I was like, oh, oops. Guess that's it. Time to pack it up, boys. Okay, we're getting lots of shit. Maybe my hat. Did I lose it on the train? God. Okay, maybe I did. <laughs> Maybe we gotta go on the train. I don't even remember when the last time I had it was. Last time I had it. Okay, let's get up here. I wonder if we can even find it. Or if it's just donezo. So this was like the beginning, right? Maybe not. Where's my hat? What if I- oh, What if I lost it when that fucker jumped me up top, that engineer? That might have been it, actually. I don't know. I just know I lost my hat. I'm gonna need to find a new one. Candy? Oh, I can't carry any more? Oh, cigars? I got a chocolate bar, though. Ooh, maybe it's over here. Did one of you guys steal my fucking hat? Arthur looks so naked without one. Okay, I'm done being a goblin. We have 33 bucks. I say that as... Okay, now I'm done being a goblin. Uh, we are down a hat, which is fine. Horse. So I'm assuming we're just gonna start the train and then our horse... Like, we'll just hop on our horse after. Start train. Yeah, probably. We're gonna send this to where it needs to go. Without <laughs> any manpower. Everyone's dead. Except the people in the back. So that'll be interesting. Bye, everybody on the train that lived. All three of you. Fun. Cool. We got some shit. 
I guess that was kind of the point, probably, of the train rob, was just for, like, the, the bonds and just all the loot we've acquired. Eastward bound. Hmm? So, we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train. A hat! We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll I feel like we should to listen to Hosea. No problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. <laughs> well then, let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. <laughs> we got our hat back, yay. So Hosea knows this place. We're going to horseshoe something? <gasps> Waterfalls. Ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me with the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. <laughs> you can buy me a whiskey. <laughs> cool. I thought we were gonna be at that other camp for longer, but I guess we're on the run, so I shouldn't assume that we're gonna stay anywhere for long. Holy shit, we're just playing? Just like that? I don't know. I'm learning how to do this. Cool. This is fantastic. Oh, waterfall. Guys, Careful now. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Accelerate. <gasps> what? Let's take a look. Did that just happen in the stream? Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, <laughs> let's get it fixed. You need help? Oh. I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wagon? <laughs> Shut up. I'm just saying. Well, say less. This is so cool. Uh, Take lift? The wheel up. I'm trying. <laughs> That's it. Bash wheel. Come on, put your shoulder into it. Nice. <laughs> See? You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. Ah, tools. Oh shit. Are those the Driscolls? What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Damn. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Huh. Story time with Hosea? The lighting. Okay, get back on the wagon. Not too far now. Stay on this trail. All right. We'll follow the river, then cut left inland. I don't like that one. That one's the normal one, right? That one's a, that one's just a wee little one. I kind of like the expanded one for some so, reason. 
Yes. The Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. Hmm. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good right. farming and grazing country. They lost it all. Stolen clean away from them it was. Every blade of grass. Hurry it up. We've got work to do. Okay, I'm looking around. I'm sorry. Right, X. Herd it up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't. In spite of that, just talk. <sighs> I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our blockheaded driver here. Hey, hey uh... don't blame it on me. <laughs> Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. This is so cool. Yeah. So, what happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. Hmm. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did, but when we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. Aww. My whole life I've been on the run. Look at all the wildlife. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Aww. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted around. That's so sad. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe huh. a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait, I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a what? long story. You wear clothes appropriate we for the environment? The, right way? That depends. the depth. Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we planned? No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. <laughs> you know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Okay. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls, our kind of place. The Driscolls? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait. What's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? <laughs> it's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him. But we kept telling him that fairy job didn't feel right. Hmm. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. It's the way it is. What is that? Always has been. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. I guess so. Oh. What are you working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Huh. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah. You can have all this. Thanks. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay. Thank you. Some herbs. These can be consumed to replenish your cores, used in cooking or to craft items. Ah, there's... <laughs> there's always more stuff. A variety of plants can be found throughout the world. Cool. Pick them to learn about their properties. That's cool. We got ginseng. Do y'all want me to read the compendium stuff as well? Because I will. I was kind of just going to read it like as I needed it, but I don't mind like just reading about it for funsies. I don't know how much. Um... Oh, it even shows like the Latin name. That's cool. Consumed to replenish your health core or crafted into medicine. Easily recognized by the long, thin stems and red clusters of flowers. 
can be found in grasslands. Cool. I like reading the animal ones. Those are fun. There's, like, I'm noticing so much wildlife, and I wonder if we can hunt everything now because of the compendium. So there's, like, I don't even know. What are those running away, scuttling away from me over there? I've seen, like, random rodents and shit. Super cool. Like, rabbits. Some random birds. I wonder if everything's, like, region-specific. Oh. Cool. It's just cool. And it's gorgeous, and I'm... just happy to be here. <laughs> I think we're... are we close to camp? We're getting there? Ooh, we're ages away. I'm okay with that. Let's just keep riding. Hopefully we get some more lore. I kind of like these uh, quiet moments of just riding along to the next destination. I wonder if it'll be frequent. But I do like how the characters talk. You find out so much just from listening. It's amazing. So, he, uh, what's his name? Hosea said that... They probably found us around 13 or old, or like a little bit older. But Arthur said that we've been in this gang for what, like 20 years? And there's no way <laughs> that Arthur is in his 30s. Unless he is, then. Like, what's this little squirrel? I think we were, are we running it over? Oh my God, we're running alongside of it. I was trying not to run it over. <laughs> okay, good. Oh, it's so green and lush. I hope this camp is nice. Waiting out the thaw seemed kind of like pesky. There you are, brother. Head in there. You follow the track for a bit. Huh? Where are you? Thanks. I don't see them. Okay. Hey, R1. Who's where are you? Oh! Are you coming? Okay, hop on. Hop on. Okay. Okay, let's go. I didn't see. Were you by that rock? Okay, we're turning. Any trouble getting in here, Oops. Nope. I don't know how to back up. Well. Shit. This is a good spot. Uh oh. Excellent. Uh oh. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, <laughs> anyway. I just- I should've just kept- I should've just committed. I should've just committed to the first turn. <laughs> now- Now I'm having a hard time getting back. That's okay. This is- this is fine. This is so pretty. It looks like we're rocking up to a freaking fairy tale or something. <gasps> we're really close. Not good at horsing yet. Here we are, oh, they've set up lots. Cool. <gasps> you were wrong, Jose. This place is perfect. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now. This is, is amazing. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Hosea. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck. East of the Grizzlies and out of money. And a long way from our dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother. But we are safe. We make a bit of money here. Then we move again. Head out around them. Be west of Uncle Sam. In a few months, buy some land. I hope so. <laughs> Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. Wow. <laughs> Gentlemen. I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. How? What does up that for mean? Robin Banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. <laughs> now, everyone, 
Put your tools down for a just moment. Just throws, Come on, just throws the axe. Quickly now. I know. Another speech from that. Things have been tough, but we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Okay. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Is now that our story or cover story? See what you can find, Uncle. Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. That's fair. Be sensible Interesting. Out to upgrade well, ammo food. Tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, this is my we room. always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson! Shave? I've seen shit with more common sense than you! Do it properly! <laughs> you just struck that on his boot? That is so badass. So we can shave? That's pretty cool. <gasps> Chapter 2, just like that! Horseshoe Overlook! I hope we get to be here a while because it's nice. It's really nice here. And there's a town of mud and morons or something? A couple of weeks later. I hope we're still here and not moved on because I want to explore. Got off the mountain and rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartlands. Ain't been this far east in many a year. Hmm. Dutch seems a little better. That's good. His eyes are sparkling once more and I can see he's thinking a little clearer. New jacket? I think we all feel a little happier. Spot of black water. We got our hat back mess. somehow. <gasps> Arthur. What? Jose. <sighs> Thank you. That's really nice. Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. The game's opening up. Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole <laughs> list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. Oh, no. Thank you. And you? I'm going to read a book. <laughs> Un... We got a camera? Oh! <gasps> Oh, there's so much. Allows you to take pictures of your surroundings. I'm obsessed. 5%. Can be found around camp. The Crinstock levels are shown near the tithing. What? 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 There's so much stuff. With renewed strength and the weather finally stable, the gang ride down from the mountains to set up camp at Horseshoe Overlook. Pick up Javier when entering. Complete within six minutes. Ah, interesting. I don't know how long it took us to like from what to what to get here. Arthur, my boy, my dear boy. Yeah. What's going on? Nothing. Nothing at all. That's good, For the right? First time in weeks. Nothing. That's We're good. Free. That's what we wanted. We're free to plan our own futures once more. I shame. hope so, Dutch. You kept the faith, Arthur. You always kept it. Barber shop. Losing it now. Look at how dapper we look. Pearson will make stew, which, okay, there's too many things happening. I think this is a perfect place to wrap up the episode before we overwhelm ourselves further. But cool that we can just pick up here, I guess. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. If you like the video, please like the video. And if you want to come back, please subscribe. We'd love to have you back. In the meantime, be kind to yourselves and I'll catch you all in the next one. Bye.